Hey folks, welcome to yet another interview. Siddharth Rajak here along with Nilesh Goswami. Nilesh Goswami is a happiness coach, life coach, and he's also an expert who helps people uh, become authors. He's also an author. He's written a book. And after coming into the coaching system, uh, the freedom business model, he was able to take his business within four months to 4.66 lakhs in total revenues. And the interesting part is he was able to achieve 2.08 lakhs out of those 4.66 lakhs in four hours. So first of all, Nilesh, congratulations. Thank you, Sin. Amazing. So j- just tell me, how does it feel uh, from, you know, from the point of struggling really hard, trying to make things work? I know you got out of the corporate world and then you, you, you stepped into your passion area and making 2.08 lakhs in four hours. What's that feeling like? It's like on the top of the world. Amazing. So the feeling is awesome. Like... Uh, uh, I was not even uh, expecting that I would be able to pull through uh, 2.08 lakhs in a month, in, in a, in a, uh, in a day, in less than a day, I think three and a half hours, four hours, I, I did that. Amazing. I was expecting uh, that maybe uh, close to 25 or 50,000, I would be able to do that. Mm-hmm. It actually turned out 2.08 lakhs. So I, that, that actually increased my conf- uh, confidence, uh, like it improved my, uh, like my motivation level has now on another level. It, it has gone up. Absolutely. It's on another level. Mm. So let's get back to your, get to your story, your backstory. Okay. Because now uh, this is what you've just achieved. And I wanted to feature you in my uh, community here and give you the visibility and stuff. But let's go back to the Nilesh Goswami before all of this. Where did you come from and how did you step into this journey of, uh, of what you're doing now? Uh, yeah, basically I am an engineer and MBA. So I have 18 plus years of experience in corporate world before coming into my, uh, this uh, coaching business and all this. Mm. And uh, I'm an ex-IES officer, Indian Engineering Services officer. So uh, I, I left my job in 2017, October 2017 to follow my passion because this was my passion and uh, I uh, wanted to follow my passion that it's high time now and mm. uh, I need to, I, I was earning close to 40 lakhs CTC that time. Mm. I, and I thought, no, no, now whatever it has to be there, I, mm. I now have to follow uh, my passion. Mm. And I started my journey. Uh, mm. I had started uh, doing my certification courses earlier in 2000, right from 2016. I did my stress management certification course. Then in 2017, I did uh, an LP certification course uh, uh, from Ram Verma sir, who is the leading NLP coach in the country. Yeah. And uh, then I started my coaching journey uh, full-fledged. In 2017, is it? 2017, I, I started. Uh, mm. October 2017, I left. 31st October 2017 was my last day. Got it. So after 18 years of corporate experience in high-level positions, you, yeah, decided, yeah. you stepped in, you took that leap of faith, jumped out of the corporate yes, race. Yes, yes. 2017, Okay, so tell me about that phase from 2017 uh, till the point you got to know about me and all the stuff. So what, what was the journey like there? So 2000, then uh, from 2017, I started conducting offline workshops because mm. that time online, uh, nobody was like, he, online is also mm. uh, the future or something. So yeah. we were focusing only on offline workshops like most of the coaches. Okay. And, and uh, that required huge investment also. Mm. And then slowly, 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 my, uh, the, the savings were <laughs> depleting. Depleting. And, mm. <laughs> and uh, but I, I was, I was uh, able to establish myself as a coach. My faith, um, I was having a face value mm. and uh, that was there, but the income levels were not that good. Okay. Mm. Uh, uh, mainly because of uh, two things. One is the investment required was high and I was not, uh, not, uh, actually putting that amount into that. Got it. So do you think there is a, there's a big difference, uh, you know, being a corporate leader in a leadership position and uh, being a business owner? No, I don't think so. Actually, mm. uh, that was the gap, uh, which was also, mm. mis- which was also responsible for uh, my not uh, mm. scaling up. Yeah. Mm. Uh, in recent time only I can I can just realized I I tell you mm. how how it happened and, and yeah tell me post, yeah. Post that only uh, so so uh, from 2017 then I I just kept on uh, going at the snail pace and it was like very slow 
Okay. And, uh, I was I was doing everything on myself, uh, like all the digital marketing and everything. I I learned through Facebook, uh, through YouTube, and all these things. Mm. And uh, then, uh, like in 2018, Ramsa told me that you sh- you should uh, go online. You should make online courses. Okay. Mm. So I made my first online course on uh, confidence, mm. and that was in September 2018. Okay. And I uploaded it on Udemy. And mm. I th- after that I forgot, <laughs> I forgot mm. that it, it is still there. And uh, then uh, I did my 14-day TTCLC program, which is a train the trainer program uh, with Ramsar only. Mm. And that gave me actually the motivation and confidence to move further. And okay. after that, and and after that I uh, made my core product. Mm. So it was uh, in December 2018, and by the mid of January 2019, my core product was ready, which mm. is reprogram your life 25 days of life transformation mm. so it, it is basically manifestation commands on different aspects of life okay wellness mm. finance relationships self love and all these things mm. Mm. so then i tried selling these uh, courses mm. and it was during that time i came into your contact okay so you already had some uh, content you already had that experience in uh, you know yes. you had some courses up already okay. yeah so i mm. so i was i was selling th- that course so, uh, from mid of January till end of uh, or maybe mid of April, mm. I sold forty six courses. Mm. Uh, but there was something missing. Mm. So, what was missing? The, mm. the, so I, that at that time I was not doing. So mm. I joined your program in January uh, two thousand nineteen only. Nineteen January two thousand nineteen. Mm. I bought your first course, Freedom Business uh, uh, Model. Mm. And uh, I just went through the first thing, Freedom Business Blueprint, and then I didn't go through any other thing. Mm. Because I was not knowing that it's a bundle. Mm. I thought that the course is over, and then I was thinking, there's nothing in this course. But what, mm. what would I do? Mm. And then uh, during the course of the, then I focused on uh, selling my pro, uh, my course. And then mm. after two months, I I realized no, there's something else also in this bundle. Mm. Then I went through those bundles, and yes, this is the thing I was missing. So mm. what was I missing is the funnel, the power of funnel. Mm. Well, I had one product. I was thinking that people are coming in my pro, uh, system. They are buying that product, and they mm. are just leaving. Mm. So that means I have to uh, siphon so many people to scale my business. Because mm. I am not using them afterward. I am not multiplying uh, those people uh, after they uh, like after mm. they are buying the course. So that was the thing which was missing. One thing. Second thing was missing was the automation of the system. I, yeah. I had to do so many things on my own. Like my wife was saying, "What have you done? You were twenty-four hours. You are on the system. You are doing uh, sending mails, sending uh, you know, like messages, and all these things." I was using ManyChat also, mm. but uh, man, uh, I was not automating it. Mm. And after that, I auto- first I automated ManyChat, and then I went through complete uh, this uh, business setup. Yeah. So I took a break after, uh, uh, like in in mid of April, we had our one to one in mid of April, I think. Yes. And then I took a break. I would, I, I said, I won't do anything. Mm. And I, I'll just make system and make my trip by course because I had my core product ready. That that is twenty five days of life transformation. Mm. So I thought I I'll make the trip by and complete the system. So okay. by end of May, I did uh, everything. Like I, uh, my system was complete. Mm. My trip by was ready. So I had done all the editing, uh, uh, recording, editing. Everything was done by at that time. Mm. Then I uh, started doing my webinars from mid of uh, June. June. Mm. In or twentieth June, around uh, around that period, I I did my webinar. Mm. And, uh, you know, the first webinar, nothing mm. happened. I know you messaged <laughs> me. You know, no one is buying. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Then, what, what was that experience like? You know. <laughs> yeah. Experience was good. Uh, mm. I I I had. Uh, at the back of mind that I, I because I was ready for that also. Mm. So uh, because I had experience during my offline workshops also the similar thing when I started in 2017. The, mm. uh, there was time when only one person came and uh, I, I conducted a workshop for that. One okay. Mm. So I had that experience. So I did, I thought uh, nothing. No nobody has uh, bought no issue. But I focus on the plus points. Mm. Yeah. My attendance was like everyone was glued, mm. so nobody uh, quit the webinar. Mm. Whosoever has joined, they 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 continue till end of the webinar. At least the end of the 
uh, content, content. Part, content mm. part. And even mo- many people were uh, there for uh, during the sales pitch also. Mm. And uh, uh, and my attendance was like uh, 40, 45 percent of the registrations. Okay, that mm. was also quite good. Very so, nice. Mm. So so I I thought that uh, problem is not there. So I, I I said I thought that this is this is a pra- these are the practice webinars. So I kept on doing four or five webinars. Mm. So then I improved a bit also uh, because uh, I had one of my friend who who used to give me feedback who used to be in that webinar. I I told him to just give me feedback where exactly I'm going wrong. Mm. So I, so I was improving uh, from point to point that uh, the sales, basic was the sales breeze, say, which is very important. Mm. Sales breeze was very important, and I was uh, lacking from uh, lacking at that point. So I mm. improved that point. And then uh, another thing which you have told in webinar selling formula that at the end, especially mm. when you are at the sales pitch, your energy should be at the peak. yes, very high. So, mm. so those two things I improved, and this has in, uh, given me benefit in uh, my offline uh, this seminar. Yes, this seminar. Uh, mm. So your your practice in the webinar really helped you exactly tell well in the offline world. Mm. Yes, yes. So I, I, I use some of the points of the webinar. Mm. Actually, this webinar selling formula, it's, it's awesome. Like, mm. uh, uh, what exactly you have to do? First, you have to do this thing. Then you have to do this thing. Then you do this thing. Where exactly you have to pitch in your story? Where mm. exactly you have to be uh, like uh, using your sales page and everything. So that was awesome. I mean, webinar selling formula, I'm just fan of that. So. And Thank I you. teach teach my coaches also that this is this is the way you need to conduct the webinar or seminars. Excellent, so, excellent. Yeah. So so, so this. Mm, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. You were saying yeah. So these factors helped you in the conversions. Mm. Yeah. So these three things actually uh, are the key takeaways. If I say what are the key takeaways, so one is the power of funnel because I power of funnel. I had mm. heard the funnels and all these things, but how important it is, I I came to know afterwards when I okay. actually learned that. So, mm. Second, second was uh, like uh, system automation. Automation. Yeah, system mm. automation, and because of system automation, I could have three different niches right now. Yes. Because I have time now. Mm. See, right, and third thing is this webinar selling formula. These three actually have uh, like changed a lot in, uh, in my business and in my in myself. Great, Nilesh. Great. So great takeaways. These are three points. So uh, July, uh, say mid June, you actually set up all the systems. You did around three, four webinars, and uh, and then when did you do this? Uh, so I think you were telling me from July onwards you started to go full on. And when did you do this uh, seminar where you did two so, lakhs? So, so actually, uh, this this uh, uh, author workshop was the first workshop. Your first ever workshop. This was the first mm. workshop. This was mm. the first workshop. Mm. Uh, actually, in July, what I I, I did, I, I opened another uh, niche uh, for the coaches. Okay. Because system was ready, and 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 see, system is for is same for offline and online. It is yeah. Same. So I don't have any issue in that because mm. in the same system I can go online, I can go offline. Mm. So I, I uh, choose a strategy uh, which which is a mix of uh, both online and offline. Hybrid. Mm. I, it is a hybrid model. My, mm. my model is a hybrid model. And uh, like in in July, I uh, I, I told you I. Uh, I had done uh, the TTCLC course, the 14 day course uh, with Ram in December. Yes. And, and I started teaching those uh, coaches. Very nice. Mm. So I, I, uh, I was, uh, I started uh, that thing in July first week. I think okay. second, I, I started that and I, I taught them the complete system. Excellent. Excellent. And those were the online live sessions. Live sessions online. Yeah. Mm. So, so like personal development uh, niche, I have all the recorded sessions. Mm. Mostly, mm. and in this niche, the coaches niche, I, I am doing mostly live courses, mm. online live, because I found that uh, they need one-to-one attention. They are not very comfortable in uh, listening the courses, and uh, so so I I, I tweaked a little bit in that case. I I thought that let me come uh, live for uh, for some time, mm. and I am giving the recordings to them. Then then they can uh, have that course also. Amazing, amazing. So I have like a, a two important questions. It's more to do with what is your view for people who are watching this? Uh, s- s- people who are in the corporate world, they are in a job. I know many people are in that segment of audience, uh, but they find it difficult to, you know, take 
make that jump to start something of their own so what advice will you give for them especially if they are somebody like you who have a passion who want to do something but they are thinking twice what advice will you give them so my point is that uh, what what exactly is going to their mind is like i let me complete this thing let me achieve this level and then i'll i'll uh, start this thing. yeah exactly and that that day will never come <laughs> it will never come so what they should do they should parallelly start doing the things mm. i'm not suggesting that they quit the job immediately and jump into this because then they had they will have a lot of pressure actually mm. the financial pressure because nowadays everyone is like under a lot of emis and all these things yes mm. if if they have some backup without any emi i'll i'll say jump jump mm. but if they have the uh, the liabilities with them then they should start parallelly because this is an automate uh, automation uh, thing yes so the system is completely automated mm. so just automate their system and everyone is having some or other other knowledge which which they feel the time good at it and i can uh, share it to people mm. so just build the courses on uh, around that so automate the system and start uh, doing uh, in the as, as a part time thing part time okay. and once 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 it, it it gets stabilized then mm. uh, it is time to quit awesome very good advice that's a good point and what uh, advice would you give for people who feel that they are not technical or they have never done this before they have never done any system because i'm sure that you come from a background where yeah yeah many many things you have learned like new and even you also mentioned yeah. one month so, you didn't do anything you sat and you put up yeah. everything so, what so, advice will you give for people who tag themselves as oh i'm non technical person i'm too old i'm too young i'm i'm a student all this kind of things let, let me let me tell you the, the the thing when i started in 2017 though i was an engineer i was an engineer i don't consider myself as an engineer right now so being an engineer engineering background people would have thought that he can do easily but i am mm. an electrical engineer mm. i'm not an it guy right okay mm. so so i made my website on my own in 4 hours on your own on my own and i was not even knowing abc of website okay i was not knowing how what website is i in fact i i used to think that website is like uh, it's a big thing and no, uh, how can i make it and all mm. but, but when when uh, like uh, there is a pressure on you everything is <laughs> everything happens so mm. it was like i was running my first uh, facebook ad that time it, uh, mm. this is uh, end of i think 30th or 31st of august 2017 mm. and i was uh, running my first facebook ad i had uh, my free workshop on 9th and 10th uh, september okay when mm. i was about to complete then it asked me about the about the website that you need to put your website detail link here yes then i thought <laughs> what is this i don't have any and uh, then i uh, and it was right super critical that i need to run ad right now because mm. time was running uh, running out so then i went i thought that let me see what exactly is mm. so i went to youtube and just saw that wordpress it's just like copy and paste mm. and thought, themes yeah mm. i i thought themes also like i used at that time i used the free theme but that was mm. 2017 theme i used yeah. and so i just learned that and step by step i like i was parallelly doing uh, on my system also Excellent. Excellent. And I four pages website, basic website. It was very mm. basic, but but for the uh, at that point of view, uh, the, at that point of time, I, it was uh, okay with me. Mm. So in four uh, four to five hours, like I, I started in um, night eight to nine eight or nine o'clock, and by two or three, it was ready. Okay. Mm. So I I'll say nothing is rocket science. Yes. Actually, it is in our mind. Mm. We think that it is difficult. That then it will be difficult. true if 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 a person can uh, write in a word uh, like they can operate that laptop they can operate the ms office and or they can they can operate the smartphone then they can have that this also they can do this also very easily it's nothing and you mm. just uh, you just need to follow the step by step in fact in your course what you have done you have given everything step by step now you do this now you do this now you do this mm. so you have to just do this and even if something is missing there you go to youtube yeah fill yeah. the gaps mm. yeah so now you now you are independent on all your systems right yes yes website management Everything. funnel funnel management right. email marketing right. uh, click tracking 
Facebook ads, uh, and of course, running a webinars. Yeah. So what's that feeling like when, once you know all of this and when you, when you can independently pull money out of, you know, the value that you give, how, how, how does that make you feel? Uh, you know, the, the, that, what I said, the feeling is like, um, now I'm, I, I feel that I, now I'm a one man army. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> because I can do each and everything on my own. I don't need any support system right now. Mm. And now I have, uh, I'm actually uh, contributing to uh, uh, my society also, the, or you can say the, my fellow coaches yeah. uh, come and uh, learn. So everyone, does, everyone does not come. But mm. uh, I have given them, them the option that you, uh, I, I am, I'm there mm. uh, to teach you. I'm there. If you have any issue, any problem, you can come to me and nice. I'm going to solve, solve that issue for you also. Fantastic. Great Nilesh. It's, a, it's an amazing story to see how you've transformed uh, from the corporate world into the coaching world, perfected, learned these new systems, refined it, and now made it into a very predictable business model for yourself. So, and you have so many people who you're, you're, you're going to be inspiring and impacting. So that is where the real, uh, you know, I would say the magic is there of the people that you can change, you know, as a coach. So uh, those of you who are watching this on my YouTube channel, you know, there's a link in my description. If you want to learn on how Nilesh actually built up the system, join me live in my next webinar. Okay, and I'll actually deconstruct the entire model on how to digitize your knowledge, how to become a knowledge giver and a digital leader within 90 days. And Nilesh has done that. And if you want to check out Nilesh's, uh, you know, his links is, I've also given some of his links. You can go and check out his website, see exactly what he's doing and how he's inspiring other people, because then that will give you the confidence that, uh, you know, that if you're in the corporate world, you want to make that jump. Yes, you can following again, Nilesh's advice, you know, those two options that he's given. If, when you ha if you don't have any, you know, liabilities and stuff, take that leap of faith and, and step into your power. Uh, if you have liabilities, start this on in parallel, start building it up and then get into this journey. So uh, I hope this uh, interview was inspirational. Nilesh, thank you so much for your time and, uh, you. and for the value that you're given to this audience here. Uh, before we go, Nilesh, do you have any final thoughts or final words that you want to, to share with, with my audience uh, when it comes to you know, success? What, what, what is your take on that? What's your one message on that? See, success is in your mind. Mm. If, because everything is projected from inside to outside. So once you need to manifest inside, if you believe that you are successful, you are. Otherwise, you are not. It's awesome. as simple as that. Awesome. Fantastic. Thank you, Nilesh. And uh, if you're watching this, uh, you know, please share your comments below on what was your biggest takeaway, biggest learning from today's uh, segment. Hit the like button, share it. Uh, with other people, pay it forward. Somebody else may get value from this particular interview. So once again, thank you, Nilesh. And uh, yeah, keep inspiring. My next interview with you when you achieve one crore. Let's do that. Okay. That will come soon. Yes, very soon. All the best. Thank you so much.